The city's study recommends that for short term residential properties, someone would have to be living at the actual property. Yeah, it's a nice place. The study also wants to put a limit on how many rooms could be rented out and the amount of people staying in them. It's just going to destroy the, the market. Chris McMinn lists short term rentals in the city. He says with fewer listings, his staff will need to be cut. Honestly, I think that it's sickening because the regulations are directly going to take the food out of disadvantaged children's mouths, just flat out. Another big change, short-term rentals could be allowed in the French Quarter. Currently, that is banned. You can see that there's just been a, a, a terrible erosion of the residential element of neighborhoods. Meg Lusto supports tighter regulations for short-term rentals. She says her neighborhood is flooded with them. In my neighborhood in Treme, there has been a house that has rented itself out for all sorts of parties. Um, one of the group of guests uh, actually flashed herself to a second line on a Sunday afternoon. So take a look. There is a community meeting where you can give your input about the proposed changes. That is set for tomorrow night at 6 o'clock. That's at the Corpus Christi Epiphany Center on St. Bernard Avenue. And again, these are just recommendations at this time. The City Council is going to review this study and they're going to discuss any possible changes with short-term rentals. Reporting live, Aubrey Killian, WDSU News.